Hi everyone, Evan here at Democronicle for April 28th, 2020, where the future starts today. I promised you this video on Twitter last night. The report I was referencing to was this Canadian housing report from TD Bank. I'll put up to two big charts from this. The first one, it shows that many of the jobs lost were from low wage earners. More on that in a second. And the second one tells us it's going to be a V-shaped recovery, which I've debunked many times on here. I'm not going to get into that right now. First for the jobs. How many small businesses have been forced to close down because of the virus? They're not coming back. And in fact, that's been the number one driver of job growth in Canada for a number of years now. And this whole thing about low wage earners, okay? How many of those low wage jobs were people needing extra income to go ahead and pay their rents, real estate investors desperately need because they're over levered? How many of those people need an extra income to go ahead and pay their mortgage, keep a roof over their head? Answer, I've spoken to a lot of insolvency people on this. You'd be surprised. In fact, what do my insolvency people tell me? After this is done, there's gonna be a second wave of insolvencies from people realizing there's no job to go back to. And guess what? An increasing share of those are gonna be homeowners. What does that tell you? And this whole thing about a V-shape. Look, I've said it on here many times. Virus was the trigger, but not the cause. The cause was excessive debt. And the way the economy was going, we were headed into a recession by year end anyways. So this whole V-shape thing, I don't know where they get it from, but look at the data before the virus. We were heading into a recession anyways. Why doesn't this report include that? Now in some defense of TD economics, everything I've seen across financial media, everything they've put out there is pushing this V-shape recovery narrative. Well, guess what? It isn't gonna happen. I've explained it on here many times. And the problem for the masses is, you know when they're gonna find out? When the virus is done, they try and go back to work and only then they realize they have nothing to come back to. That's my big issue here. Look, I can rant about this all day. In closing, I'm just gonna say this. To the people in finance that constantly push this V-shaped narrative, all I can say is, and myself included by the way until about a couple of years ago, whew, get out more, will ya? That's all I'm gonna say. Smash the like button, leave a comment, Subscribe, follow me on Twitter, peace.